EBS Chapter 12 Our Need for Food This girl had become very thin and weak during her illness. After a few days, she recovered and became fit and healthy again. What helped her to recover? In the illness, this girl did not feel like having enough food. There was some wear and tear of the body too. But after her recovery, she resumed having her regular diet and therefore she became fit and healthy again. Can you tell what makes this baby gain height and weight? Baby's mother gave him some milk when he was small. Later, she also gave him some simple food. Due to such feeding, the baby gained height and weight. Why do we feel hungry? Our body must function properly. That is why we need food. Food helps our body to grow. It helps to repair the wear and tear of our body. It also gives us the strength we need to work. If we don't get enough food, we feel tired, vigor is lost. At such a time, we feel very hungry. If we eat a little, we feel better at once. When we work a lot, a body feels fatigued. It makes us very hungry. Like us, all living things need food. Can you tell, do all living things eat the same kind of food? No, every living thing eats the type of food according to its way of life and structure of body. A cow eats grass. Would a cat live on grass too? Cow is a herbivorous animal. It eats only grass and other vegetables matter. Cat is a carnivorous animal. It hunts and kills mice. Cat will not eat grass. However, sometimes cats are seen nibbling grass as a medicine. A cat loves to eat mice. Does that mean a goat will also like to eat mice? Cat is a carnivorous animal. Goat is herbivorous animal that eats shrubs and grass. So goat will never eat mice. To eat their own food. New terms, oil cake. The fibrous part that is left after extracting oil from seeds such as groundnut, sesame, or cotton seed is pressed into slabs. This is called oil cake. Amban, a fermented mixture of oil cake, jaggery and coarse particles of grain mixed in water and used as animal feed. All living things need food. But all living things do not eat the same kind of food. People who keep cattle feed them grass and hay and also oil cake and amber. Besides grass and hay, horses are given Bengal gram, harbara soaked in water. Goats and sheep eat the leaves of various kinds of shrubs besides eating grass. Cats love to drink milk, but they like mice just as much. They also hunt and eat birds such as sparrows, doves and pigeons. Dogs may eat chapatis or bakris, but they prefer to eat meat. People who keep dogs or cats give them meat and fish also. In forests, animals like the deer, bisons and nilgai 
eat various kinds of green grass and leaves. If there are crops growing in fields nearby, these animals finish off those crops too. Wild animals like the tiger and lion live in deep jungles. They hunt other animals and eat their flesh. Usually, these animals do not hunt in human settlements. But sometimes, when they are starved, they are forced to eat nearby villages. Then they kill and carry away cattle. Many times, foxes dare to enter human settlements, but they are not as strong as tigers. They cannot kill cattle. They are mostly content with stealing fowl. Use your brain power. Why do farmers set up a scarecrow? and use slingshots when the crop in their field are ready for harvesting. We see many differences in what birds eat too. Many birds eat grains. Farmers grow a variety of cereals and pulses in their fields. As the crop becomes ready for harvesting, the ears become full of grains. Birds in the surroundings come in flocks to feed on them. They can destroy the crop. What is done to prevent such destruction? It is easily possible for birds to find grains in areas where people live. That is why some birds live in such areas. Other birds feed on other kinds of food. Hens eat worms. Crows eat the flesh of dead animals. Some birds eat the fruits of trees. We see many small animals around us. What do they feed upon? Bed bugs suck people's blood. Ticks suck the blood of cows and buffaloes. House lizards and chameleons eat insects. Caterpillars and some insects nibble at and eat the leaves of plants. Butterflies feed upon the nectar they find in flowers. Animals eat the food they find in nature. However, they have to wander from place to place in search of food. Do you know there are many types of mosquitoes? Most of them suck the sap from the plants. Only a few types of mosquitoes suck our blood. The food of plants. Plants too need food, but they cannot move from place to place in search of food. Then, from where do you think they get their food? The roots of plants absorb water from the soil. Some substances from the soil are dissolved in this water. This water reaches the leaves of the plants. There are many tiny pores or openings on the surface of leaves. They are so tiny that we cannot see them with our eyes. Air enters the leaves through these pores. Thus, Air and water come together in the leaf. In the presence of sunlight, plants make their own food using the water and air in the leaves. A plant's food is made in its leaves. Sunlight is necessary for this purpose. Process What we have learnt Living things need food. Food gives the body strength to work. It helps the body to grow and to repair its wear and tear. Animals search for ready food in nature and eat it. Food of different living things is different. Some animals eat the flesh of other animals. Some eat grass and leaves. Some suck the blood of other animals, while others eat insects.
some insects feed on the leaves of plants. With the help of sunlight, plants prepare their own food. Always remember, the entire living world depends on the food prepared by plants. What's the solution? A potted plant is not growing well. It needs help to grow better. For proper growth of plant, it needs water, manure and sunlight. We will water the plant every day. We will add manure to this pot and will loosen the soil near the roots. We will allow the plants to get enough sunlight. In this way, if care is taken, then the sapling will grow. Think and tell. What major differences between plants and animals did you come to know from this lesson? Which difference did you know already? Animals wander from place to place to find food in nature. They get ready food and eat it. Some animals eat grass and leaves while some animals eat flesh. Plants prepare their own food with the help of sunlight. For this, they absorb water with the help of roots and take in air through tiny pores on the leaves. Animals move on their own but plants cannot move. We knew this difference already. From the following list of animals, pick out those that eat flesh and those that do not. Lion, elephant, donkey, wolf, deer, shark. Animals that eat flesh, lion, wolf and shark. Animals that do not eat flesh, elephant, donkey and deer. A tiger eats flesh and so does a vulture. But there is a difference in their feeding habit. What is the difference? Tiger hunts live animals and then eats their flesh. Vultures eat flesh from animals that are already dead. They usually do not hunt. Tiger has sharp teeth and pointed claws for hunting. Vultures have curved beak to pull flesh out of the body. Complete the table. Write what they eat. Goat Grass and leaves of shrubs Butterfly Nectar in flowers Caterpillar Leaves of plants Mosquito Sap from plants Fill in the blanks. When we work a lot, our body feels fatigued. 2. All living things need food. 3. Usually wild animals do not hunt in human settlements. 4. Only a few types of mosquitoes suck human blood. What do the following animals eat? Name of the animals, the food they eat. Cattle, grass, hay. Horse, hay, Bengal gram, harbara. Deer, bison, green grass, leaves. Tiger, lion, flesh of other animals. Tick, blood of cows, buffaloes and dogs. What do the following terms mean? Oil cake, the fibrous part that is left after extracting oil from oil seeds is pressed into slabs. This is called oil cake. Ambon, a fermented mixture of oil cake, jaggery and coarse particles of grain mixed in water and used as animal feed. Answer the following questions. Why do we need food? We need food to help us grow, to repair the wear and tear of our body and for strength to do work. 2. Where do animals find their food? 
Answer 2. Animals eat the food they find in nature. However, they have to wander from place to place in search of food. 3. How do plants make their own food? Plants make their own food using the water and air, carbon dioxide, in the leaves, in the presence of sunlight.